Oh my god, I'm working with a playlist from February because that's how long it's been since I've listened to new music. I need to stop saving music for these reactions because I'm clearly not filming them. What's up internet, my name is Savvy. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're here for the first time, I guess. This is New Music Friday where I listen to music for the first time on camera and give y'all my immediate reaction, okay? So we're not thinking about it, we haven't ruminated on it. This is the first time hearing this music, except for not all of it because I had to listen to this one first. I know I'm fine. I won't lie, that extra coin don't hurt, but I get funny, baby. I just rather spend yours first. She has one of the hardest verses I've ever heard and I'm obsessed with it. If you've been on TikTok at all for like the last two weeks, you know this song. I ain't got shit to say, let's get into this reaction. First track is from Jack Harlow. He got nail tech out. But Sammy, this was released so long ago. Like this is literally such an old song now. Yeah, I know and I still haven't fucking heard it, so. <laughs> Nail tech knows how to keep a little secret. I don't wish for my success. I speak it. I caught a buzz and you did too, but you tweak it. I look like I've been getting money. How reek it? You smell me? That's LV. Walk around with my chest out of my skin smooth. I'm healthy. Yeah, I caught the vibe that y'all giving off, and I'm trying to make myself less like it. This chick got a little push body. I might let the bro test drive it. Ride around in the shot, got her tested. Hanging both of my legs out it like, what's up? I got stakes and they too high now. I can't fuck up. I like girls that's down to earth, so don't be stuck up. I don't take L's, I give them out and I chuck them up. Fam of a gram, that's my MO. Fucking close friends, I got friends that I keep close and Yay. they let it go while I reload. Like, bow, bow, bow. TSA just open my book bag up and my chain hit like, and I'm not no fashionista, but I'm fly though. And I know I gave up drinking, but I'm high though. I told her I don't come from here, but you can try though. They treat me like I'm chosen. Eyes open, heart clean, my mind focused. This shit just keeps going. How I wrote it. How the hell could you doubt us? Ten toes, that's my MO. Fam of a gram, that's my MO. Fucking close friends, I got friends that I keep close and they let it go while I reload. Like, TSA just open my book bag up, my chain hit like. She down low three point stands. I'm back there doing jack dance like bow, 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 bow. Love it on the playlist adding it immediately everything about Jack Harlow's confidence is What I aspire to like just knowing that I am the best no one compares to me But at the same time understanding that I'm still growing the way that Jack Harlow, like, it's, all, I, all I did was listen to his song and my lip is quivering. Like, hello? All right, my baby Khalid has a new song out. I'm so excited. This is Last Call. I think he has a new EP coming out soon. Change the world and shake you free. It's not 2017 anymore. <laughs>
y'all know I'm in love with him. It's such a romantic song without being a super romantic song because it's like this isn't a quick hookup but it's also probably not like forever long term so it's like somewhere in the middle we'll be riding around drop top when it gets hot please sign me up for that this man is from the south he knows the heat okay so i kind of didn't give a fuck about the order of this playlist this time normally i would just do it in chronological order of like the oldest stuff to the newest stuff but i don't give a fuck this time so we're gonna listen to the new Camila Cabello and Ed Sheeran track. Heard some things about this. I've heard a teaser. You said you hated the ocean, but you're surfing now. <clears throat> I said I love you for life, but I just sold our house. Oh, that's fucking sad. We were kids at the start, I guess we're grown ups now. this approach to a breakup because obviously we know this is in reference to the Sean and Camila breakup. I love this because it acknowledges the batshit craziness of ending a relationship, especially a long-term relationship. I haven't had a lot of long-term relationships. Like I've never lived with somebody. I've never had a house with somebody like Miss Camila over here, but I can't imagine the mess that that would be. But I love this because it, it, it acknowledges that. And then it's like, you know what? It's all right, life goes on. And it's got this really nice, fun beat. Love the production of the track. Love that Ed Sheeran is on the track. I loved their song together in 2019 for his project. South of the Border was one of my favorite songs on that album. So it's really fun to hear them coming back together. I think their voices work really well together. I really like his voice in this kind of music. So <sighs> kind of warms my heart and breaks it at the same time. You know the feeling. Certified breakup bop. That's all I have to say. All right, my girl Kehlani put out new music. Y'all know how I feel about her. Let's listen to Little Story. Ma'am, where are we going? Wanna say I'm alive, but I'm not always honest. Ooh. Ooh. I ain't come through, but that's why I ain't promised. You gotta face that I could lie to.
way Kehlani's music feels like home, the way it feels like it wraps me up in a warm, sultry, sexy hug every time I listen to it. Like her vocals, her vocals are my sexuality. And I love the dynamic of this song because it definitely moves into like almost a dream sequence type of space that I could quite frankly live in and be happy forever. All right, Ms. Jasmine Sullivan got new music out. She added some bonus tracks to Hotels from last year. Last year or the year before? January 2021. So like this bitch was like, oh, you know what? I think I remember making some other songs. Let's put those on the album too and then just drop it again and we'll just call it Hotels Motels. And we say, yes, ma'am, thank you. Anyway, this is roster. like full on R&B bop. If it, if it just had a little bit more, if I just got like a beat underneath here, so a little bit more dynamic, if I had something, if I had something with it, the way, um, I would be obsessed. Can you just imagine, imagine, imagine. What I really wanna do is just add my own little sauce to it, you know, like a just a little, just a little, just a little sab sauce in there. Make me a producer, I want to make music. That would be so much fun. Next track, Everybody But You, featuring Ben Barlow. This is New State Champs. They have a new record coming in May that they already have like four songs out for. This is what I don't like. I don't like when bands do this, when they tease music for so long that you've heard half of it by the time it comes out. Cause then it's like, well, what the fuck was the point of, of, of singles? Other than to just string me along for months. I don't need you to do that. I have dating apps.
That melody is gonna be stuck in my head so fast. Okay, I understand that my pop punk persona is like a completely different side of my personality. I get that, I've accepted it. And I like that about myself, you know, range. I, th th the way that Ben from Neck Deep sounds with state champs, I'm gonna have to listen to it again because I don't know, I don't know, I don't know how I was feeling. That halftime breakdown at the end though, loved it, loved it. Love the production, love the drums. Evan Ambrosio is one of my favorite drummers ever. And I got to meet him once and it was magical, loved it. With this whole like angsty kind of vibe that pop punk has that's like kind of aggressive, but kind of just wants to go home and like be by myself. Perfection. Next track is for the gays, the girls gays the days on my channel. I am honored to be a part of the community here. Baby by Charlie XCX. Let's fucking go. Okay, I was not a big fan of the last song I heard from this project. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay, y'all are gonna hate me, but I don't like this. I don't, I don't like it. It's not for me. Out drunk at a gay bar with my besties? Yes, yes. But just casually on my playlist, no. Sorry. I don't think I'm a Charlie XCX girl. I don't think I am. And it kind of breaks my heart because like queen, but. <sighs> I'm sorry, I don't like it. Last track of New Music Friday is for my diehard Five Seconds of Summer fans. If you've been around for a couple of years now, you might have seen my Five Seconds of Summer reaction, but there's not very many views on it. So like, I don't think you've seen it. So if you want to see it, go see it. This is complete mess. I am obsessed with Callum and that's the only one I care about. So I'm just kidding. They're all great, but like, I only care about Callum. Bye. The birds in the background, a little, a little melodramatic, but I kind of like it. about their music is that it's always created in a way that's just harder than life. brand for five seconds of summer very much man band as y'all have kindly pointed out to me multiple times after i called them a boy band 
I'm sorry. They're fantastic musicians. They're fabulous writers. I'm, I'm, I'm a fan. I'm a limelight. That's what we are, right? We're limelights? Oh, shit. <laughs> limelights are why don't we? I love them too. I think that's the one that I called a, a boy band and people jumped down my throat. So maybe y'all didn't come after me for that. But the five SOS fam, real ones. That's it, you guys. New Music Friday is over. I really appreciate you guys. I appreciate you watching the channel, interacting through likes, through comments, having your feedback, having your support. It all really means the world to me. I do have an Ed Sheeran reaction that is edited, uploaded, everything ready to go. Drop a comment if you wanna see that and we'll make it happen. If you miss me on YouTube, you can always find me on social media, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, I'm HeySav pretty much all over the internet. So come and find me, let's be friends. I miss you guys a lot. I really wanna to get to a point where I'm making more content for you. So here's hoping that 2022 is better for me this year as far as content creation goes. I love you, I hope you're safe, I hope you're healthy. Thank you so much for your support again and I hope I see you in the next video. Mwah.